What's up, you baby fucking frogs, and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto Online news and information video here on my channel today. My name is iCrazyTeddy. As always, if you guys are accustomed to seeing Grand Theft Auto 5 content and would like to see more, be sure to subscribe to my channel. It is free of charge and it only takes a couple seconds out of your day. Apart from that, guys, we're actually going to be going through a couple images today which were found on a video which were linked to me by its creator a couple hours after the actual video or a couple minutes after the video was made. And apparently, GTA Online users have been able to get the heist update early, or so it seems. So supposedly people are able to go into their apartment, stand next to some sort of printer, and from there gain some sort of exclusive access to a user interface or a supposed heist selection menu as it's being called over the internet. I'm actually going to be showing you guys an image on the screen which was sent to me by the creator of this gameplay, and he actually sent this to me the day or a couple seconds after he uploaded the video, and from there I took a quick glance of it, really never thought of it much, but over the past couple of days has been blowing up on multiple forums and threads my youtube subscribers are telling me that people have gained exclusive access to heists and lester did this and that and invited these many people to heist and all this crazy shit has started but unfortunately however exciting this is and it has been probably one of the best hoax over the past couple of weeks unfortunately i do have to say that this is fake there are many reasons as to prove it's fake of course the heist text itself if you guys look at the user interface it actually says request heist job that text is actually smaller than all the other ones including the grayed out ones as well as that he's hovering over the set bounty he also said that his controller seemed to have froze and also in his youtube comment section over on twitter he did actually admit that this was faked and he just did it for fun i have to give it to him though he did have me going for a couple seconds there and then i of course needed to double check the image just to check its uh, legitimacy and from there went on to his video checked the dislike to like ratio and it was kind of standard and it proved that it was a hoax and all that sort of crazy crap it was my initial response and of course no one was tricked on that day probably had a couple people going but i really liked the way he presented it. it was nice slick and clean a lot of 12 year olds these days are wasting their time by making fake dlcs like the fuck me in the ass update and inspect elementing a bunch of shit which is a complete waste of time but this one this one was slightly different, so a couple people did get tricked by it, however, however much exciting this is, and we do want heist, I'm here, unfortunately, to tell you guys that this is fake. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to do me a huge favour, and leave a like if you do love me. Subscribe to my channel if you are new, because over the next couple of days, I'm going to be live streaming Grand Theft Auto Online here on YouTube, and you guys will get a chance to play with me and a couple of other YouTubers, so if you're excited for that, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Let me know what you think about these fake DLCs down below in the comment section, and apart from that, guys, my name is iCrazyTeddy, and I will see you guys when I see you guys. Peace out.